because we were called from the very beginning. But I think in many instances, the church kind of lost their focus and our challenge in this 21st century is to know and understand that a uh, part of our mission is outreach. A part of the mission that Christ gave the church is outreach. And so we have got to be very intentional about reaching out to the community to okay. continue to do that because if we don't do that, we are not then the church that Jesus called us to be. Amen. 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 Reverend Mama. Well, you know, when I am out, a lot of people just talk about this event. This is mm -hmm. a, an event that the community looks forward to. I know that you do other mm -hmm. uh, events in the community. What are some of the other events that you do? Well, I think uh, a couple of our signature events would be the feeding of the multitude, which started, I guess, well, well over 30 years. Wow. I think it was the pastor, uh, pastor's vision to feed 5,000. That was, you know, from the biblical text. Yeah. But uh, as we have done it year after year, we have exceeded the 5,000. So now we just call it the feeding of the multitude. That is wonderful. And so we do that uh, Tuesday. Wednesday and Thursday, the week of Thanksgiving. Uh, we distribute food on Tuesday and Wednesday, and then on Thursday we have a great sit-down dinner uh, for the community. So that's one event. And then the other that comes to mind, of course, is the book bag drive, which we do getting our kids ready for school in September. Uh, I think we do that the last weekend in August. So those are two things that we have done over the years. Yes. And uh, we're very proud of what we do. And we also understand that it's a little bit more than we probably need to do. Well, you guys are very active in the community. Well, come on, y'all make some noise out there. Yeah. So, Reverend Lane, there may be somebody out there now, and they may watch you on television, the broadcast, but. You know, to get them out and in the fellowship, what are the times of the service here at Greater Allen? Okay, on Sunday, we are 7 o'clock, 9 o'clock a.m. and 11.30 uh, a.m. 7 a.m., 9 a.m., 11.30 a.m. Okay, and the website here is greateralancathedral.org? Yeah, www.allencathedral.org. Allencathedral.org. So now today we've had many sponsors, and you know what's been so awesome? If a sponsor was not able to support this year, God always supplied another sponsor for you. Yeah, I remember when Toys R Us was a sponsor. That's a challenge. Yes, and, and to see the lines and those that came out, and, and you have always have made it an opportunity for anyone. You didn't discriminate anyone that was in need. The church was here oh, for them. Yeah, we made it. We made it. We made it. Yeah. We made it with you too. Yeah. Yeah. We, we love being in the community. We love being with you. And is there anything you want to say to those that are out there before we conclude? Well, I just like to first of all thank the volunteers uh, from this church. Yes. Who have, uh, Yay. Been in the planning stages for, for weeks, for months, and then um, we're just so very proud of this church and the membership 
uh, we are a great church only because of the people who are members of this church you and the service that they give, uh, the sacrifices that they make. Uh, you know, they had to take off from their jobs and yes. do all kinds of things to get here today. And so I want to say thank you to everybody. And then, of course, um, to the community, we just would solicit your prayers and your support. And we certainly invite you to come and worship with us any Sunday at 7 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and 11.30 a.m. Amen. 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 That's a great way to conclude Christmas on Merrick on 1190 WLIV. And we look forward to coming back again next year. Right here on Radio Christmas on Merrick. Y'all make some noise. for you and until next time go in peace grow in grace and don't just go to church